For rehab, motor learning, metabolic conditioning, or a variety of reasons, the body weight or air squat is an effective exercise in your arsenal. Begin in your squat stance. Be sure to check out this video for a brief explanation of how to do this. For many people, this will be with the feet slightly wider than shoulder distance apart, with the toes or feet pointed slightly away from the body. Training goals, mobility, and technical preference may affect this position. Next, hinge back at the hips, keeping the back straight. Allow the knees to travel forward as the hips drop down to the bottom or hole position. As the knees travel forward, they should remain within the boundaries of the feet, not collapsing inward or outward. In the bottom position, the spine is relatively neutral. Slight rounding of the low back is alright. The knees may be a bit beyond the toes and the heels are firmly planted on the ground. Drive up out of the bottom position, allowing the hips to come forward, returning to the top position. Careful not to overextend the low back or hips at this position. Repeat for the desired number of reps. This is the basis for all squat variations and loads. I highly suggest seeking the services of a good coach if you advance to weighted variations.